A hate crime in Everett. Someone ripping the cross from the yard of a predominantly black church and throwing it into a yard nearby. As WBZ's Julie McDonald reports, church leaders are vowing unity and say it won't stop them from practicing their faith. Everett is a uh, community where we've not had a lot of this. We are hoping that this isn't the beginning of something new. An overnight act of vandalism has left a vibrant church community reeling. Zion Baptist's roots in Everett date back more than 120 years. Early Thursday, a large cross was found thrown in a nearby yard. It had been ripped from the ground. This cross is precious not only to members of Zion Baptist, it means something to everyone who believes. It's funny, we've had people standing at the bus stop and have turned around and, and watched them uh, have a prayer or two. Said it's repulsive. Uh, it, uh, we're, we're disappointed, we're distraught. Uh, Everett's mayor said such crimes will not be tolerated anywhere in the city. Local and state police are investigating, and he adds whoever did this will be held accountable. Removing a cross from a place of worship is a hate crime. It's been painful for church leaders and members, but it won't change this congregation. The cross will go back up. We're not going to be deterred from doing that. It is a symbol of our faith, and we're not going to let anybody move us from that at all. In Everett, Julie McDonald, WBZ News.